Hello everyone, I am Kushal Jain. Today I will be showing how to create a speech recognition program or we can say speech to text program in Python language. For this, we will be needing some libraries of Python that are called Pi Audio and Speech Recognition. So I will be showing, uh, showing that later how to install those libraries. First of all, we'll uh, we'll be starting with the program. So the program goes like import speech recognition, which is the library that I was uh, mentioning uh, earlier in this video as s. So we'll be giving it the name s. S R equals to s dot recognizer and then for the input we'll be declaring the microphone after the microphone we'll be Telling the program to use the mic as the source for the signal for the audio signal this statement is for the is for the non detection of the noises around the computer system or the microphone so that the system only and only recognizes and catches the voice signal given by the user now we'll print a statement so that the user knows that the, that now the now the program is listening to him so i'll write For an instance, I will take this as the sentence which the program will print at the start of the program. Audio equals to sr dot listen. Now we are asking asking the system to listen to the voice. And this is the timeout. After the time, program will stop listening to the voice commands. I will keep it 10. Now print sr dot recognize. This will print the audio signal which was taken by the system, and this is for the language. This is for the language part. I will try to run this first. Sorry, I was. I forgot to add the dot over there. So, sr dot adjust is the command. Hello, Python. Hello, Python. I'll try again for a new sentence. Hi, Python. How are you? So this is how the program works. Now if I want to let's say add a new language to this then the syntax will be
Konechu. So this will write in Japanese because the uh, the code J is is for Japanese. It is predefined for Japanese. So that that's pretty much okay. Thank you for watching. Have a good day. Stay safe. For the libraries, I'll I'll be telling you the commands which you have to type in the command prompt window. They are pip install pi audio. Since it is already installed in my PC, so it will be showing requirement already satisfied. Then you have to install pip install speech recognition. It is also installed, so it will be saying already installed. If you are getting an error called cannot find or locate or cannot identify pip as an internal or external command then you have to install the pip command and if you can't do that with pip you can use pip win the command goes like pip install first install pip install pip win and then it shows the requirement is already already satisfied so now go on to pip win install pi audio now it will be downloading the file of pip win install uh, pi audio since it has found the pi audio in my cache cache memory so it will firstly download the pip win and then install the pi audio from my cache memory so after trying to install it will say in case you have uh, the pi audio already installed it will show you that requirement already satisfied same thing you can do for the speech recognition module